Hello all. Uh, just uh, read over some comments about a really cool program called uh, Redshift that adjusts the color of your screen according to your surroundings. And I was looking at the Arch Linux documentation and it was mentioning about uh, system units, system D units, and uh, display managers and stuff. Um, none of those seem to work. <laughs> Even when you copy them to the Etsy system D system and then tell them to run, they just fail. Uh, so I just uh, went through and installed Redshift through Pac Man and made sure I had all these dependencies listed here, which I did uh, GeoGlue, which is a location, libdrm, uh, lib, and so on. The important, one, um, the important ones for the redshift-gtk, it comes with both, is Python G object, Python XDG for, I guess, auto start, I'm not sure, uh, lib SVR, lib R SVG, scalar vec vector graphics, and uh, so I just, uh, if you look here on my start menu, there's redshift. Okay, so I can also do this, just run it. Using GeoGlue, now watch my screen. Now I don't know if this is a desired effect, uh, but you can see my screen is much darker, going very dark. That's it. That's all I had to do. I didn't have to. There's no system services running. I just you can tell it to run at startup or not. Press Control C, give it some time to exit, and you can see my my screen is back, and that's. All I had to do, and if you want, you can uh, run it and you click on info. Oops, I'm sorry. I just quit. Sorry about that. Try that again. Click on info. Look at this. The coordinates are correct. I automatically found them and see the color temperature. You can see it's changing. The period is night, and that's exactly what it is. And I just uh, enable or disable okay so I'm not sure what the, the Arch Linux documentation is uh, going on about um, it is confusing but I just installed it and it seemed to run so I hope that helps anybody out there that's completely confused about this um, just give it a try install the dependencies I'll, I'll post them but it's on the, the uh, in the Arch Linux documentation anyway but I'll post them what you need and just run it either from a command or from your uh, whatever you're using for a menu okay so that should do for this one and thanks so much for watching and we'll talk to you soon and bye for now